Rabbi Shlomo Kabach once came across an Alexander Chassid who was describing to him what it was like to spend Shabbos by the Alexander Rebbe before World War II. And he was going on and on describing how beautiful it was to sit by the Rebbe's tish and how exalted the prayers were and what it was like when the Rebbe looked at you and said, L'chaim. And that Shabbos would give them strength to go from week to week to week to week. But then the Chassid paused and he said, but you know something? Let me tell you, one Friday night in Auschwitz, somehow I met another friend of mine from the town of Alexander who also used to attend the tishes of the Alexander Rebbe. And we sat there late at night on Friday night where no one could see us, and we began to reminisce. And we began to remember and recall all the moments and experiences we had sitting by the Alexander Rebbe. And let me tell you this, Chassid told Reb Shlomo, at that Friday night, how we experienced all those Shabbos together in one moment, I could never ever describe to you in words what it felt in Auschwitz to feel all those Shabbos together. You see, dearest friends, sometimes we feel just a little bit while things are taking place. But sometimes we have to lose everything in order to feel it all together if we just allow ourselves to remember and recall and think about what we had. This is the world we're living in now, a world that doesn't have a Beit HaMikdash, that doesn't have the light and the glory of Yerushalayim yet restored the way that it once was and the way that it will be again. But when you close your eyes and you let it all sink in together at one moment, you can bring it all to your existence right now.